the Highland National Chase is next and the rain is coming down it's 3 miles and 7 furlongs 0 to 120 handicap Ronaldo Alex Cherry Clara Poos Pete Fotheringham Sang Bleu Craig Beckwith Moon South Tavern David Rawson Charlie 2 Thomas Rogers Opus Safari Ryan Costello Camp House Pete Fotheringham Dictate Ross Martin Liam Stagecoach Graham Clutterbuck Sonic to Dream James Shea Altona Dan Hughes Da Vinci Paul Rhodes Blue Penny Martin Liam Southern Spectrum Alex Cherry and No More Heaven for Paul Road, so 15 then starting on the winning line and away they go and it leaves them behind the little shed thing and stagecoach looks like it's going to go on they've got 23 fences to take in this and I would suggest they've probably popped three circuits I'm not 100% sure it might be a particularly big truck well, I doubt it, we'll soon find out anyway and it's stagecoach in the lead then as they get to the first and they're all safe here one or two mistakes most particularly by Camp House in the pink jacket down on this near side but Stagecoach has settled down in the lead then from Reynaldo in second and a bit of a gap to Da Vinci with Opus Safari Dictate Ross the first of the greys Clara Poos the second grey on his outside then Charlie Two and then a third grey Altona in the blue jacket with just in behind that one Sang Blur and Blue Penny the second of the horses in the red rum colours as they get to this huge looking ditch and over that one they all go with No More Heaven the current back marker but Stagecoach is then in the lead coming down to the third Gave that on plenty of air. So we've seen the whole field streaming over it, and they're already pretty strung out. So Stagecoach must be sitting a pretty stiff gallop with Clara Poos now moving through in a second. Ronaldo and Dictate Ross third and fourth. Then Da Vinci and Opus Safari with Sang Blue and Altona. Then Charlie Two after that one. Sonic to Dream wide on the track. Bit of a gap to Blue Penny. And then behind that one is Southern Spectrum and Moon South Tavern. And then two of the were out of shot camp house and no more heaven as they take the fourth. And they're all jumping well so far. As they race towards the final three miles of this. And stagecoach is in the lead. And it's running really wide at the back there. No more heaven. Even though quite a bit of ground. Maybe he's looking for better ground on this near side, but he's quite a long way detached as they take that ditch. And these fences look big, but they look pretty soft as well. So they're getting through them okay, and Stagecoach is in front. Dictate Ross has now moved through into second. Clara Poos on his outside is third. Then comes Renaldo on the rail fourth, with Opus Safari in the green and white. And that one's inside Da Vinci as they take the sixth. Safely over that one as well with Moon South Tavern, the back marker in shot. But no more heaven is behind him somewhere as they take number seven. And all Moon South Tavern right down on his nose there nearly exited the race but Stagecoach is in the lead by four or five to Dictate Ross in second then Reynaldo is back in third Clara Poos is fourth Opa Safari is fifth as they take the water jump and then go past the winning post you can see that they have got two more circuits to go and Stagecoach is the lead by five lengths to Dictate Ross in second Reynaldo third Clara Poos is four and then Opus Safari is five. Then comes Sang Blur and Altona with Da Vinci after that one. And then Camp House who's moved forward a little bit. Blue Penny being just niggled along a little bit. Moon South Tavern after that one. And then Charlie Two as they get over number nine. And a bit of a mistake there by Charlie Two. Sonic to Dream towards the back and there. Southern Spectrum is the back marker. But Stagecoach is a good five lengths clear. Dictate Ross in second. Ronaldo's now moved through into third. Clara Poos is fourth as they come to this ditch, which is number 10. Oh, nicely over that one as well. With the order staying pretty much the same. That leading five have been the leading five throughout. The order hasn't changed amongst them much as they get over number 11. Mistake there by Clara Poos. Might see that one drop back a little bit. Look at that Moon South Tavern creeping into it. The jockey doesn't think we're a circuit ahead of ourselves because he's made a pretty significant move from the back to about sixth. And there's still the best part of two miles to go. So Stagecoach is in front by about four to Dictate Ross in second and Ronaldo third. Gap of about three then to Opus Safari and Clara Poos and Moon South Tavern and Altona as they get over number 12. 
I'm safely over that one with Southern Spectrum. Just the bat marker, but not by a lot. Charlie 2 and Sonic to Dream are also in that little bunch at the back. Stagecoach is clear in front, happily bowling along in the lead by himself. No company. Next to this ditch gets over it nicely. Dictate Ross over it in second. The rest of them stream over behind. And all still on their feet. They've taken 13 of the 23 fences. And raced down towards the 14th with Stagecoach in front. That one I think will be the last on the next circuit. Oh, there's a four of their Southern Spectrum's gone. So that's the first one to depart the race. And now this is the one that'll be the last on the next circuit. And there they go all over that one. All safely over there. Now they'll take the water jump, which is in the shadow of the post. And then on the final circuit, they'll take the little chute and bypass the water jump which you'll see in a second as they come up past the stands and now they're going to go past the winning post there you see it there's the water jump they're all over the water there's the winning post and there's the little shoot that they'll come up next time around so swinging right handed then for one more circuit of the track and it's stagecoach who's clearing the lead by four lengths to dictate Ross who's second and then Ronaldo is third Opus Safari is four no more heaven has moved up nicely into fifth then Sam Blur and Altona Cal Clara Pusa has dropped back a little bit Camp House chasing that one then Moonsell Tavern Da Vinci Charlie two and then at the back there Blue Penny and Sonic to Dream as they take the 17th which they're all over nicely and making their way now towards the final mile in this Durham National and it's stagecoaches in the lead Highland National isn't it? Stagecoach in front then from Dictate Ross in second then Rinaldo is third and Opa Safari is fourth they're beginning to bunch up behind there Clara Poos is making a significant move forward and sangbler has gone there so Sangbler the second one to depart the race then now it's Stagecoach still in the lead from Dictate Ross and Ronaldo. Clara Poos is after that one they take the 19th Really good jump again there by Clara Poos. Blue Penny towards the back. Down on her nose is probably beaten now. But it's Stagecoach who's still in the lead from Dictate Ross second. Ronaldo being given the hurry up. Then comes Clara Poos and Opa Safari. Altona is now sweeping into it. Then comes Camp House. No more heaven. Charlie two's after that one. Da Vinci's lost its place as they're racing down there towards the final four fences in this one. And it's Stagecoach who's in the lead. Altona's now moved through into second as they get over it. And that's the first time the leader's made a mistake. And now he's been caught immediately by Camp House. Moon Sal Tavern was a faller at the back, but Camp House has hit the front. Altona has gone with it. Suddenly it's all changed up top. Stagecoach is back into third. Reynaldo's losing his place as well. Charlie Two's coming around the outside. So Two's no more heaven. Dictate Ross is going backwards. Blue Penny's trying to run on. One's being pulled up at the back there as they take the third from home. That was Sonic to Dream being pulled up. But it's Altona and Camp House then disputing the lead from Charlie Two and no more heaven. Then comes Ronaldo. Dictate Ross. Stagecoach is now beaten and they race down towards the second last now and Camp House has gone for home over the second last Camp House lands in front from No More Heaven in second Charlie Two's in third Ronaldo's a faller it's Camp House in front then Camp House from Char No More Heaven Charlie Two dictate Ross from Ring and over the final fence they go and it's Camp House in the lead Camp House from No More Heaven Opus Safari and dictate Ross trying to run on but it's Camp House who looks like he's got to take it racing into the final half third on Camp House from No More Heaven dictate Ross back in third Blue Penny finishing fast but up to Towards the line, it's got to be Camp House that takes it. Camp House is the winner, no more heaven. Second, Dictate Ross, third, Blue Penny, four, and then Opa Safari and Charlie, two. And all the way back to Stagecoach, who was a long time leader, finished last. So, one or two fallers in the closing stages, then the final circuit. But a good win by Camp House, who I think was the first horse to make a mistake in the race, but I'm not sure it made another one after that. So Camp House takes it for B. Fotheringham. No more heaven for Paul Rhodes was second. Dictate Ross and Martin was third. It was also, they also had fourth with Blue Penny. And then Opa Safari was fifth for Ryan Costello.